Imagine a river flowing with more than just water, a river that carries not just stones, but treasures of unimaginable value, gems that have traveled through time and earth, ready to shine in the world of luxury. But here's the catch. These treasures aren't formed in the way you might think. They're created through a fascinating natural process. A process that turns ordinary rocks into extraordinary sapphires. This is the story of how a river gives birth to sapphire babies. Sapphires, renowned for their beauty and rarity, are often associated with luxury, elegance, and timelessness. But behind their breathtaking colors and lustrous shine lies a fascinating natural process that gives birth to these precious gemstones. This process, occurring in specific river systems, has been the subject of curiosity and fascination for centuries. In this video, we will explore how these rivers play a crucial role in the formation of sapphires and their journey to becoming the gemstones that grace our jewelry collections today. Sapphires are a variety of the mineral corundum, which is composed of aluminum oxide. The only other gemstone that forms within this mineral family is ruby, which contains trace amounts of chromium, giving it its signature red color. Sapphires can appear in a wide range of colors, from blue to yellow, green, and even pink, with blue sapphires being the most famous. Sapphires form deep within the earth, under extreme heat and pressure conditions. Typically, these gems develop in metamorphic or igneous rocks. As molten rock, magma, cools, it forms corundum crystals that will eventually become sapphires. The trace elements present during this process, such as iron, titanium, and chromium, are responsible for the sapphire's color, with blue sapphires containing higher levels of titanium and iron. Sapphires don't always form where we find them. While sapphires begin their formation deep within the Earth's crust, over millions of years, geological forces like erosion, volcanic activity, and shifting tectonic plates bring them to the surface. Rivers play a key role in the transportation of these precious stones. The process begins when sapphires, along with other minerals, are released from their primary sources through natural weathering and erosion. Once released, these gemstones are carried downstream by rivers, sometimes over vast distances. As the water transports the stones, they become smoother and more polished, ready to be discovered by miners who sift through the riverbeds. One of the most famous rivers associated with sapphire mining is the Mong La River in Myanmar, Burma. This region has long been known for producing high-quality sapphires, particularly the prize blue variety. Another notable river is the Sapphire River in Montana, USA, which is famed for its rich deposits of sapphires, often found in the river gravels. These rivers act as natural sifting systems, washing away smaller particles and leaving behind heavier gemstones like sapphires, which are easy to collect. In these riverbeds, miners use a technique known as panning, which involves sifting through river sediment to find gemstones. While sapphire mining provides significant economic benefits, it also brings challenges to local communities. In many regions, mining for sapphires can create jobs, boost local economies, and provide essential income for families. However, the environmental impact can be severe, as the extraction process often involves extensive land disturbance and water pollution. Additionally, unregulated mining can lead to the depletion of riverbeds and surrounding ecosystems. Responsible mining practices, however, can help mitigate these effects and ensure the sustainable extraction of sapphires 
The allure of sapphires is not limited to their beauty. They are also valued for their durability. Ranking second only to diamonds on the Mohs scale of hardness, sapphires are ideal for use in all types of jewelry, including engagement rings and fine necklaces. The global demand for sapphires has been rising steadily, with markets in Asia, Europe, and the United States driving much of the demand. As the world's appetite for sapphires continues to grow, the search for new sources of these gemstones intensifies. This has led to the expansion of sapphire mining operations along river systems in both established and new mining regions. As sapphire mining becomes more widespread, the industry faces growing pressure to adopt sustainable practices. Innovations in mining technology, such as more efficient sifting techniques and eco-friendly extraction methods, are helping to reduce the environmental impact of sapphire mining. Furthermore, ethical sourcing initiatives are being developed to ensure that sapphires are mined without exploiting workers or damaging ecosystems. These efforts reflect a growing awareness of the need for responsible gemstone production and a sustainable future for sapphire mining. The journey of a sapphire from its formation deep within the earth to its final appearance as a polished gemstone is an awe-inspiring process. Rivers acting as natural conveyors play a crucial role in bringing these beautiful gemstones to the surface, where they are collected, mined, and eventually admired by the world. As the demand for sapphires continues to rise, it is important for both miners and consumers to recognize the value of sustainable and responsible mining practices. The story of sapphires is more than just about their physical beauty, it is about the natural forces, human ingenuity, and ethical considerations that shape this gemstone's journey from riverbeds to jewelry boxes. As we continue to marvel at the allure of sapphires, it is essential that we appreciate the intricate process that gives birth to these breathtaking sapphire babies from the very rivers that transport them to our hands. As we continue to seek out these stunning gemstones, let's not forget the importance of preserving the very rivers that give them life. Responsible mining and sustainable practices are essential for ensuring that these beautiful treasures continue to shine for generations to come. So the next time you see a sapphire, remember, the journey it took to get to you is as beautiful and fascinating as the stone itself. From riverbeds to jewelry boxes, these gems tell a story of nature, time, and the remarkable forces that shape our world.